Hi, my name is James Stuckey. I'm a third year drama and acting student and I'm here to be your guide. Our city campus is made up of three main locations, Bower Ashton, Arnold Feeney and Spike Island, which are both renowned contemporary art centres. Now I'm here to show you the best technical and creative resources that UWE has to offer. This is Bower Ashton's main theatre. It has some of the best lighting and sound equipment and together with the studio and Arnold Feeney's theatre, it provides drama students the best facilities to devise their own work. This is the newly furnished student hub. It gives you easier access to your student support services. And with a new SU shop and art shop, it gets a wider range of resources and equipment at your disposal. As any student will tell you, the library is where you'll spend most of your time. So we have opened it 365 days out of the year from 7.30 in the morning till midnight so you can make the most out of its resources. Here we are in Fashion Textiles room which is equipped with industry standard sewing and sample rooms. Now if we go down one floor we'll go to a photography which has analog and digital dark rooms. Traders is a social space and for me it was a place where I like to spend a lot of my free time. With the use of the Student Union Bar and the on-site cafe, it was a great place to get a bite to eat and drink. There's an on-site cash machine and with such a large area, it was a great place for societies to meet up and for activities to be held weekly. The Fabrication Centre in D-Block is split into two wings. On the east side, we have ceramics, casting and hot lab works, while on the west side, we have metal, woodwork and a tech lab. Now on the upper floors, we have the interior design studios and the foundation year studios. The F-Block Newsroom and the Broadcast Quality Radio Studios are here to give the students a taste of the industry standard. Now if we head down the corridor, we'll see the five digital design studios fitted with Macs with the software like Adobe After Effects, Illustrator and InDesign. If we head upstairs, we'll see the illustration studios as well as the multi-purpose gallery. C-Block is made of many different centres including the internationally recognised Fine Print Research Centre, the Textiles Printing Centre, the Fabrication Centre and the Digital Printing Bureau, all together providing equipment ranging from lithography and etching to 3D printing and laser cutting. The central loans desk is where you can hire out all the media equipment that you will need, with staff running throughout the day to answer any of your queries. Now, for you to use this equipment, we have several amazing film production, TV and photography studios, along with post-production facilities with mixing, dubbing, grading and editing. UE Bristol's fine art studios and facilities are located on the ground floor of Spike Island, an internationally renowned contemporary art venue close to Bristol's floating harbour. It is also home to a gallery, cafe and working space for artists and designers, providing UE students with fantastic exposure and industry links. City Campus also shares the iconic Arnold Feeney building on Bristol's harbour side, home to one of Europe's leading centres for the contemporary arts. The top three floors accommodate our programmes in graphic design, drawing and print and fashion communication. UE students can also access the Arnold Feeney's ground floor auditorium for lectures and drama workshops. And this concludes our tour of Bower Ashton. I hope you enjoyed yourselves and I look forward to seeing you on campus.